Right, let's have a look at this one then. fx is a cubic, it's 3x cubed minus 8x squared plus 3x plus 2. So we need to look for the factors then. So let's try f of uh, 1, because that looks quite promising just by looking at it. Because you've got a 3 times 1 cubed is 3. This is minus 8. This will be plus 3, won't it? And then you'll have a plus 2. And that equals 0. So x minus 1 is a factor. Minus 1 is a factor. As such, we'll be able to write f of x is equal to x minus 1 times something equals uh, equals the 3x cubed minus the 8x squared plus 3x plus 2. Now what are we going to write? The first thing I need to do is just write down the quadratic here. So um, to get 3x cubed I'm going to need a 3x squared here. That will give us 3x cubed, but it'll also get a minus 3x squared. We have minus 8x squared, so I need a minus 5x next. And that will combine with that to give minus 5x squared, making a total of minus 8x squared. But it will also uh, produce a plus 5x. I've got plus 3x, so I'll need a minus 2. That will go with that to give minus 2x. And then I'll be left with the plus 2 at the end. So that looks fine. So that's equal to then x minus 1. So 3x. Mm, not enough room there. So I'll put it down below. So that equals what have we got then? We've got x minus 1 times the 3x and then what have we got? We've got an x. That'll be the 3x squared. Then the 2 can only be two ones. It's either here or here, but I've got a minus 5. So I'll put the 2 here to be with the 3 and a 1 there. This will be a minus, won't it? And that will be a plus. That will then give me 3x squared minus 6x plus x, which is minus 5x, and minus 2. So that looks like it's the, the answer there. And we can just get rid of this if we wish, just to delete it, make it look tidy. Okay then. There we go, it's factorized.